Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make a car rotating effect in After Effects. Before we begin making this effect, first of all we should stabilize the video in the center, or what we call a lock on stabilization. Let's click on stabilize motion. Make this track point slightly bigger and then move to the center of the wheel, cause we are going to lock on the wheel and center it. Now click on options here and make sure to select RGB and then check adapt feature on every frame and then click on OK. Now click on tracking forward button and wait until it's done. As the tracking is done, click on apply and then hit OK. Now we can close tracking window and go back to our main composition. Press S on your keyboard to open scale, then scale the video until black edges are gone. Once you are happy with it, make sure to enable proportional grid, this will help you to find the very center of the screen. Now simply drag your video until the wheel is centered like this and then let's check it. We can disable proportional grid once we center the video. Nice, the video is all centered and stabilized and now we can make rotating effect, but first of all, make sure to pre-compose your clip. Name it to whatever you want and then make sure move all attributes and adjust composition duration is selected and then hit OK. Now scroll to the beginning of the clip and we will need to mask the wheel, to mask I will use Mocha AE. In Mocha select elliptical tool and mask the wheel as smooth as possible. Once you are done, enable perspective and then click on tracking button. As the tracking is done, click on save and close Mocha AE. Now expand matte and click on create AE masks. Let's rename this layer to wheel and then duplicate it. Select bottom wheel layer and delete mocha AE on it. Then press M on your keyboard and delete the mask as well. I will rename bottom layer to original for example. Now press R on your keyboard and click on rotation stopwatch icon to create a keyframe. Then scroll in the middle of an original layer and rotate it 180 degrees. Then scroll to the end of the layer and rotate it to 360 degrees. Let's quickly check it. So now let's select all keyframes and press F9 on your keyboard to easy ease them. Then go to graph editor, right click there and select, edit speed graph and then simply make a smooth curve like mine. Let's close graph editor now and make sure to enable motion blur on original layer. It looks already cool, but now let's fix these black edges. Add motion tile effect on that layer. Check mirror edges and then change output height and width to 200. Let's check it again. Let's add some shakes now. I will skip shakes part because I have made too much shake tutorials. Also I have made 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description. Check how it looks like with my shake presets. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.